My, both my parents ride, used to ride with the squad as EMTs, and that got me interested into it. And the second reason was because when my mom got into an accident about five, six years ago, I couldn't help but feeling a uh, lack of responsibility. There was nothing I could do. I was helpless, you know. My mom was sitting there bleeding, hurt, and there was nothing I could do for her. So I just didn't want to have that feeling again. So I joined the fire company, and this way I can help people and do what I can, what's right, and hopefully save a life or save a house. I was Van Dorn's lumber yard. It came in about 8.30. Uh, it was February 21st, 1991. I will never forget this. Um, we had, at the time when the fire came in, it was a very small fire. Within 15 minutes, it had spread over 200 feet into the rest of the outbuildings. By the time <clears throat> an hour went by, we had four buildings fully involved. We had major structures that were in danger. And we had to kind of contain the fire. The intense heat was enough to, to burn the house next door. We were uh, very fortunate of uh, the training that we have that uh, we were able to save that house and we kept the fire under control into that area. And I classed the fire as being under control after about four hours, four and a half hours worth of fighting. We we're, we were pretty close, you know. If one of us goes down, it's not like oh well, it's just another person. It's like a member of a family. We're like just really close to each other. 